How's it going everyone? My name is Jermaine Grant and today I'm going to very quickly show you how to do the cinematic black bars opening crop effect. It's a very long title but uh, <laughs> let's just get straight into the video. So as you can see we have the clip in our timeline or my timeline. The first thing we're going to do is we're going to create an adjustment layer. Once we've created that we're going to drag the adjustment layer into our timeline. Make sure we drag it above our existing clip and um, just make sure that the adjustment layer fits the length of the clip. Next thing we're going to do is we're going to open the effects panel and we're going to type in the search box crop. Don't forget to highlight the adjustment layer as well and we can either drag the crop effect into the effects control panel or we can just double click it. I'm going to double click it, a bit lazy. And so what we really want to do is that we want to animate the top and the bottom crop. We want to make sure that our playhead is at the beginning of the clip as well. We're going to highlight the animation effect of top and bottom and we're going to set these both to 50. Okay, so we're going to scroll along our timeline, say about here. We're going to set another two keyframes. One, two. And we're going to set them to 12.5 top and 12.5 for the bottom so this basically mimics the 21 by 9 aspect ratio but in a 16 by 9 sequence so you're not really getting true 21 by 9 you're just getting that letterbox effect that is it if you want to make it longer highlight these two and push it towards the end of the clip and if you want to make it shorter push it towards the beginning of the clip And that's it really. If you want to smooth out where it stops, highlight both of them again, right click them and select ease in. That basically slows down the keyframe towards the end. And that's it, nice and easy. Guys, thank you very much for watching this tutorial. Don't forget to comment, like and subscribe. Let me know if you want me to do any more tutorials or if you need help doing anything inside Premiere Pro let me know and I'll make a tutorial on it. Don't forget to also check out the other videos on my channel and um, I will see you lot next week. Happy days. <laughs> Take care.